hello friends welcome back to innovative design tutorial so friend today we are going to create this uh, part and we will also apply the intermittent building symbol in solidworks there is, it is uh, basically we will make the building with uh, uh, desired length uh, separate y so here we will keep <coughs> building sorry so look how we create this uh, just we see this so here we will keep the fillet 15 mm fillet belt so we can uh, edit feature and now we will see how we here we will select intermittent well and gap and well length so we will keep 20 mm and gap we will keep 15 mm so look how we create this so we uh, just go to the file select new here we will select part ok and now we change the background to plain white here we will select front plain right click sketch go to the uh, rectangle we will create center rectangle ok now go to the smart dimension select this line and he, it will keep 130 mm ok now select this line and make it 15 mm ok now here we will uh, make the extrude so go to the feature select extruded boss base and we will keep extrude this sketch 300 mm ok now again we select this face front face of this extruded boss and we will create a sketch right click a sketch normal here we will create center rectangle corner center center rectangle select this point create up to here go to the uh, smart dimension select this one select this line here we will keep 130 mm ok now we select this line make it 15 mm now here it's time to make the student to this sketch so go to the feature select student boss base make it reverse and here we will untick this merge result ok now we will create separate bodies and we will not merge in single part so here we will go to the weldment select weld width and here we will select face so we will select first face and second face here we will keep selection and uh, we will create fillet belt 15 mm now here we will tick this intermittent belt and here we select gap and weld length so we will create weld length 20 mm and keep the gap 15 mm ok so we will create this now uh, here we want to see this belt width so go to this one and select belt width so look how we uh, show this belt width apply to this part modeling okay and uh, we, we will apply this so here we will keep uh, 15 fillet and we will the number of belt will be 9 belt width length 20 mm and gap 15 mm so look so again we create a sketch on this face so we will create this uh, center line straight slot ok now go to the center line now here we create one center line from this midpoint go to the smart dimension select select this uh, point 
and this point and here we will keep this length 45 mm again go to the smart dimension select this point this one and we will keep gap 25 mm okay and now again select this edge and this center point we will keep 53 mm select this center point and this uh, edge we will keep it 40 mm now here is time to make the mirror so here we will select this mirror entity select this sketch and mirror about this center line okay now again go to the circle and create this circle from this midpoint go to the smart dimension select this circle and make it 30 mm sorry not uh, we will keep 300 we will keep 30 mm okay now here we will keep the extruded cut so go to the extruded cut and cut up to here okay now again we just do same thing on this face so go to the right click sketch normal and here we will also create this straight slot so we will keep So here we will create this uh, state slot. Now it's time to create center line. So we will keep it mirror. So go to the center line. Create center line from this midpoint. Make sure it is uh, vertical to this point. Now we select and make this mirror. Okay now again we create one more circle to this center point so here we will create circle go to the smart dimension select this circle make it 30 diameter okay now here we will uh, make it 53 mm from this edge okay now here is time to make the student cut so go to the feature select student cut and up to next okay now here is time to make this chamfer to this four corners so go to the this chamfer select this one and here we will keep 10 mm 20 mm and make the angle 45 so we will keep the chamfer like this this one again go to this chamfer command now select this both edge okay now here is time to make this color so we will change this appearance so we will uh, now select this go to the appearance select boss stored okay now here we change this color.
colors so we will keep this green color okay select this slot so guys this is the intermittent build symbol uh, basically it is uh, we will keep this building to make this